Good morning, everybody. I'm Frida Stauffer, and it is 2.15 a.m. Um, this <clears throat> is the last night before I start tapering off on my uh, steroids. I have not been able to sleep very much this week. I, I didn't force myself either. I just uh, <clears throat> watched TV and relaxed as much as I could and ate a lot and my face is really puffy. Um, I have a, a mouthful of thrush from all the steroids and antibiotics and my mouth hurts so bad and my stomach too but um, <clears throat> I'm awake and not sleeping and it's kind of I don't know, annoying and funny at the same time. Um, my husband has cooked really great food all week and fed me well. And um, I can't wait to start eating more just normal. <laughs> but steroids are horrible. They uh, stimulate your blood sugar and give you a ravenous appetite and the only good thing is that they help you breathe when you have pneumonia or or a horrible asthma or bronchitis flare up then they help you recover but they're only good in the short term long term is bad Anyway, I know a lot of you have had experience with steroids and sleepless nights and extreme hunger, and thrush, and pain. <laughs> um, I'm looking forward to tapering them off and just returning to my regular uh, steroids maintenance uh, medication, which I take a low dose all the time but it wasn't enough to stop COVID pneumonia. <laughs> um, I had to add uh, some Philips colon, colon health probiotics because um, I could tell that I needed it. My stomach was all messed up from um, the antibiotics and killing all the good bacteria. So that always helps. Uh, recover some. I'm still taking all my vitamins, the zinc, the vitamin D, the vitamin C that I'm supposed to take until they're all finished. The melatonin helps a little to sleep at night, but not really. Not when you're uh, on those horrible <clears throat> death and mexazone, which is a which is the COVID uh, steroid that you have to take. Prednisone is regular. Death and zone is next level. It's horrible. Um, so I feel for anyone who's been on it, and I, I don't want anyone who hasn't had it to need it. I have an appointment for my um, <clears throat> second shot on Wednesday, and um, I intend to fully vaccinate because it's possible to re get reinfected. So I wanna be as cautious as I can and also take any booster they allow me to have after that. In uh, including I'm gonna take the flu shot because uh, I, I don't wanna take chances. I take, I get sick with everything. Every little virus my kids get, every uh, little sniffle turns into something major for me. So I'm gonna take all the vaccines and all the precautions I, I have never been like this until I had kids going to public school, getting all these viruses and bringing them home. <clears throat> I was pretty okay when they were online schooling because they didn't get um, they didn't get exposed, and I didn't get as exposed. But 
this is weird to me to be so uh, susceptible to everything. <clears throat> but not anymore, it's, it's become the norm. Anyway, so I, I just wanted to check in and chat and I'll add some clips of food my husband made this week and things. Thank you for watching and, and thank you everybody who's been supportive of us and praying and everything. <clears throat> uh, I'm still eternally and endlessly grateful and um, fully and uh, aware and, and uh, thankful to all of you for so much, how much you put into um, supporting us and, and, and leaving comments and kindness and um, you put so much of yourselves into into that effort and and I want to uh, recognize the beauty in you and uh, and let you know that it means the world to me how you've how kindly you've been to me and how much love you guys have showed us so um, I will uh, say goodbye right now on that note and and I'll be around. Bye bye. Beautiful breakfast. Oil eggs, black olives, a slice of bread from Whole Foods. How about you, douche canoe? Stop coffee. Look at this beautiful salmon and rice lunch my husband made. Here on set. With some fried tomatoes in it. And some salad with ranch. Mmm, yummy. <laughs> looks so delicious. There's Sakia's plate. She has some Parmesan knots and pizza and uh, marinara to dip it in. And tablet. And a tablet to watch something on YouTube.